vowel sounds A and I. Okay, so as you know, English is not a phonetic language. So we have different sounds that come with different uh, letters that you might not see when you read it. Okay, so we're going to go over what some of those sounds are now with A and I. Okay, what are vowel sounds? Okay, so we have five vowels, A, E, I, O, and U, sometimes Y in American English. Um, vowels are the flow of air from your lungs that passes through the mouth, okay? Minimal obstruction and without audible friction. Okay, so audible friction is what we do when we make a consonant sound like T or D or S, okay? So we produce uh, vowels using our vo by vibrating our vocal cords, okay? But we have different types of vowel sounds, all right? One is voiceless. So it can be pronounced without the vibration of the vocal cords, okay? It's more like a whispered sound, okay? Um, vowels are divided into two main categories not to get too technical, okay? But one group is called diphthongs, okay? So it's a long vowel sound. And the other monophthongs, which are mainly short vowel sounds, okay? We love both short and long today. Don't worry about the technical names for them, okay? You can just say long or short sound. First, let's look at A, okay? We'll have a chance at the end to do some practice and to ask some questions, okay? So for now, I'm just explaining. So the short A sound is like the vowel in the word cat, okay? So it's an A, ah. very short sound, A. Ah. That's the short A sound, okay? Um, this is something you'll see that's common, okay? Almost like a rule. There may be exceptions, okay? So when a word is a short word, uh, starts with a consonant, ends with a consonant, like bag, cap, cab, fan, it'll make a short vowel sound, okay? Um, also, when the word starts, a short word that starts with an A, like act, apt, okay? Actor, there'll be short A vowel sound. Okay. When a word has two vowels separated by two or more letters, okay, the first vowel makes a short sound. So let's look at the word apple. We have two vowels, A and E, and they're separated by three consonants, okay, separated by three other letters. So this is a way that we can tell that the A sound is short. Okay, if it's separated by two or more other letters, like in the word apple. 